Python has an equality operator, equals equals, that checks whether two objects are equal. But it also has an is operator. What's the difference between these? Let's say we have two variables that point to two lists. When we use the equals equals operator to check whether these lists are equal, we'll see that they are not equal. These lists don't have the same values right now, so they're not equal. Let's update the first list so that these two lists do have equivalent values. If we use equals equals again, we'll see that these lists are equal now. Python's equals equals operator checks for equality. Two objects are equal if they represent the same data. Python also has an is operator. If we use the is operator between these two objects, we'll get false. Python's is operator checks for identity. An object is only ever identical to itself. The variables a and b point to different lists, so they're equal but not identical. Let's point another variable to the same object as one of our existing variables. We've just pointed c and a to the same object, so if we ask whether these two variables are identical, we'll see that they are. Changing the list that either of these objects points to would seem to change both variables. This happens because variables in Python are pointers, and we've pointed two variables to the same object. Python's equality operator checks the value of two objects. The equality operator delegates to one of those two objects and asks the question, do you represent the same value as the other object? That's up to the objects to answer. Python's identity operator doesn't even look at the objects. It just looks at the location of the objects. Python's ID function returns a unique number for each object that it's given. If we check the ID of each of these variables, we'll see that A and C have the same ID. Python's is operator checks the object ID that two variables point to. So if the ID of two objects are the same, that means the objects are the same. Python has an operator for equality and an operator for inequality. Two objects are equal if they represent the same value, and they're unequal otherwise. Just as Python has an operator for identity, the is operator, there's also an operator for non-identity, the is not operator. The is not operator is one of the few operators in Python that's made up of two words with white space in the middle. Equality checks are very common, but identity checks are a bit unusual. You'll pretty much only ever see the is operator used with special values where there's only one of them in memory. These are often called singleton objects or sentinel values. Checking for Python's none value is by far the most common use of the is operator. There's only ever one none value in memory within each Python process. When we use identity to check for none, we're asking the question, is x pointing to the one and only none value? Sentinel values are pretty much the one place you'll see identity used, and none is by far the most common sentinel value in Python. Equality checks whether two objects represent the same value. Identity checks whether two pointers point to the same object. Equality checks are very common. Identity checks are a bit rare. Identity is most often used to check for none values.